everyone, welcome back to Miss Fanya class. Today in science lesson, we are going to learn about natural and man-made materials. Alright, did you know that the things around us are made of materials? But where did the materials come from? So, to answer this question, let's we learn together. We can divide it material into natural and man-made. We can get natural materials from living things such as animals and plants. We can also get materials from the ground. Now, man-made. Man-made materials are materials obtained from natural materials through chemical processes. Alright, let's take a look at the example of natural materials from animals. First, wool. We can get wool from sheep. It can be used to make woolen sweater. Second, leather. We can get leather from cow and crocodile. It can be used to make bag and belt. Third, silk. We can get silk from silk worms. It can be used to make silk dress and silk tie. All right. Now let's take, let's take a look see the example of natural materials from plants. First, cotton. We can get cotton from cotton tree. It can be used to make shirt. Next, wood. We can get wood from tree. It can be used to make door and chair. Alright, next, rubber. We can get rubber from rubber tree. It can be used to make balloons and eraser. Alright, let's take a look at the example of natural materials from the ground. First, rocks. It can be used to make statue and clay. It can be used to make bricks and gold. It can be used to make gold rings. All right. So now let's take a look at the example of man-made materials. First, plastic. Plastic is made from oil that comes from deep in the ground. It can be used to make plastic bags, plastic toy, plastic cup, and straw. Next, glass. Glass is made from sand and limestone. It can be used to make magnifying glass and glass jar. Next, paper. Paper is made from wood. It can be used to make newspaper, book, and cardboard box. The last one is concrete. Concrete is sand and gravel mixed with cement. Cement is made from limestone and clay. It can be used to make bricks, root, and building. Alright everyone, that's all for today. I hope all of you understand about our topic today. 
Thank you for your attention. See you in next lesson. Bye-bye.